hello, hello, and welcome to Your Beautio. Welcome back to the channel. It's lovely to see you again. Thank you very much for stopping by. This is your place on YouTube, on the internet, the World Wide Web. This is what the internet was created for, for you to come on and watch videos of an Essex boy talking about Sir Beautio. Vlogging, blogging, all that malarkey. This is the bit before we get into it when I ask you to be ever so kind to share the video to the world, subscribe, turn on the notifications, and of course, tell all your friends. And as many of you know as well, I am all over social media, so wherever you buy your social media, search the Beautio Collector and have a look at what I'm posting. Whether it be collections of the team, retweets of other people's stuff, I'm out there doing it, trying to bring to you the best Sabutio content there is. Guess what? It's happened again. We're unboxing a Sabutio set. Oh my God, can you hear it? It's rattling away. Oh, I'll tell you what, this, this has got a good story to it, I think. It's a set that I've got, but I'm pretty sure the box is slightly different. I look up there because I'm looking, and it's been a couple of weeks since I actually got it. Still just not had the chance to open it. A bit like my last video, I'm so behind on getting into stuff. But I'm finally here, it's rattling. But let me tell you the good story behind it first. Before we unbox it, this has got to be the best sales technique ever. The best sales technique ever, so I was contacted, as lots of people do. People like to drop me emails where we're just talking, people like to offer me stuff, blah, blah, blah. But occasionally we come to a deal. So I was emailed offering me this, a few bits of spirit. I said, oh, okay, that sets different to the one I think I've already got. I'm interested, but I don't really want to pay, I'm not sure if I want to pay that amount of money, you're based all the way out there. So in the end, we agreed a price, and then I said, but would you ship it? Because I don't really fancy the drive. Well, <laughs> they guys, this is, this is the good sales technique. They asked my postcode, so they could look up the price of shipping. I, uh, I gave them my address so they could look up shipping. Next thing I know, I get an email saying that they've sent it. <laughs> so whether I like this or not, I suppose I've got to pay for it, which I have already. If I'm brutally honest, I have paid for it already. The pictures look quite good. I'm quite happy. I gave them a little bit more than the price I was originally willing to pay because I do see how much they paid for shipping and they did it. But what a good sales technique, right? You ask someone for their address to see how much the shipping will cost and then you send it to them. Cracking idea, absolutely banging. So if this is rubbish, which I'm sure it's not, I've got to say that because hopefully the person that I bought this off is watching and I'm sure this is perfect. That's why I put all my faith in it, looks at the pictures and that's why I paid the money after I received it as well. But let's jump down to the table, let's have a look and let's see if it is actually different from the set I've got. Come on down to the table and we'll have a peek together. So there she blows. We have the trusty knife stolen out of the kitchen drawer, as always. Let's start hacking into it. I think when I looked at it, the difference was it wasn't teams or anything like that. It's a stadium edition, which I've already got up there. And I just think it's got a different color on it. I think it just might be blue. Uh, like, oh, it's green box, of course. I think instead of having like the red circle, it might be blue. Something like that. I'm trying to be careful as I open it because I feel like everything's gone everywhere. Not that you can probably hear me talk under this cardboard cutting. Well packaged. Oh, you know when you see something, you guys might not be able to see it. Can you see it? Look, 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 look. See right there, pictures of it. Oh, it's exciting. It's just, how are we going to do this? What's best? Cut the top off, rip the cock. Let's just do it that way. Let's hack into it. It has, look. Got blue. You might, can you guys see it's got the blue? Blue right in the one I've got up there is red. The things you do as a collector, eh? To like have every different type where you buy the same set because it's got different writing on it. Oh, still getting in. We're in. This is actually in lovely condition. I'm scared to take it out. Am I gonna get my hands? I can't get my hands in there. Need some leverage. Some really good nick. Oh, I'm excited. There you go. Okay. Yes, fingers up. Yes. Okay, okay. Gently. Easy. 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 Nothing's falling out in the box. Nothing's falling out in the box. Okay. Ooh. Sabutio, the football game. I don't think I've got one that actually says that. Have I? I've got the stadium edition. Oh yeah, I have the World Cup edition box up there, says it. Okay. Grandstand edition, I haven't got this set. That's why, 
that's why it's different. The version I've got is the stadium edition. This says grandstand edition. Let's just put my fence back, neat and that back up. Wow, I've not got this set. That is absolutely pucker. Game of the year, 1987 to 1988. We should have in it, oh, this is also, I'm just gonna stand it up like that. Oh my God, you can't even see it like that, can you? Let me try and move the camera a bit. Can I move it, will it happen, will it happen? There we, there we go. Look at, just, just, just stand in its glory. The grandstand edition. We get three teams. We get loads of stadium accessories. We get goals. We get scoreboard. We get corner flags. We get a fence. We get the grandstand. There's everything again, all along the top. Grandstand. Throw in takers, corner kickers, scoreboard, dugouts, referees and officials, teams. Oh, stadium accessories. Look at, I mean, look, it's a bit worn. I don't mind. Look at that picture on the box, right? Isn't that right? When you was a kid, it was in the 80s, the 70s, you was doing it with the green version, when you were doing the 90s like me, isn't that what you dreamt of creating as a kid? That stadium. Oh, we've got to get into this now. We have to get into it now. Okay, where's my knife? I've lost my knife. I'm scared. I'm a little scared. Because you know when everything's come away everywhere. Okay. I don't know, I suppose one thing I wouldn't have done if I was out sending it, I probably wouldn't have taped the box shut because, as it, oh, a oh, little bit of dust. What that does is it does ruin the box a little bit, but I'm not moaning. I'm not moaning at all. Missed a bit of tape there. I can see some fans, look. I'm opening it upside down, look. It's good job I had that look. Woo! <laughs> There's our fans. We've got some subs in there as well. Okay, here he goes. Sliding it out. I can't slide it out. Oh, it's got an FA Cup in it as well. Broken FA Cup there, look. There's a, a jolly little cameraman. There is my camera, look, it's falling out. I remember him saying, when I looked at it, I, I, I know the price I paid. I didn't pay it with everything being fixed in mind. Oh, God. Oh, that's a team I've not seen before. Oh, who are you? All right, let's put the box down on the floor. Whew! All right, we've got a broken FA Cup. This is gonna be, I'm gonna lower it down a little bit. We don't need to see everything. You wanna be able to see, there we go, look. Nice, now you can sort of see what we're doing. We've got referee, linesman, flag's gone. We've got a bit of a throw-in taker. We've got another linesman about his bit. And we've got some ball boys. We've got a base, which would have been for one of the cameramen. We've got an array of corner flags. We've got a sub. We've got another cameraman. We've got some more stadium accessories. The camera. I knew these were broken when I bought it. I'm not at all disappointed in these being broken. I'm very happy with the price I paid, it's very fair. We've got some policemen. We've got the policemen. I'm gonna show you it all properly in a minute. There's the top of the FA Cup. There you go, looks like Bommy Yang's had his hands on it, doesn't it? We've got the stadium, should we check the stadium out? Side panel, side panel. We've got the front, this is a good look. Oh, hello. Oh, he's gone, Michael Jackson, look, smooth criminal. France, I think. Goalkeeper, there you come. There's another stadium bit, really, look. Falling out of there. All this, all the stadiums there. All the stadiums there. So what we're, we're missing? Missing a couple of glass side bits on the old stadium, but could be in a bit underneath. Plumber policeman, we've got some kickers. Mic man. Mic man, there's the cameraman falling off his base. Look. Another throwing stand. Who is this? Who is this, Tim? It's got to be a Coventry City or something, isn't it? Anyone know? Any takers? All right, forget everything I've just said. This is a fine. This is reference 187. Originally 4-4, carried on by a Maltese side that I'm probably gonna say wrong. Similar Wanderers, 187. Now, check this out on the Magado scale with the Mingado scale. I don't know how accurate this is. I don't know who created it. Just because they say it's rare, is it? They have a rating of one to six. Six being the rarest, one being not the rarest. This is five. This 
is awesome. We've got a nice hand painted reference there. Oh, we found a rare one. We always love finding the rare one. Forget everything else I say about it in this video. This is rare. Booyah! Looks like a hand painted lightweight to me, which makes me think it maybe wasn't the original. I'm also thinking it could be a repaint, maybe. I'm sure someone out there will be able to let me know in the comments because I'm really not sure. It could be a hand painted lightweight. In fact, look at his hair. Well, should we go as far as to say that that's a repaint? I don't think there was ever any beauty of hair done like that back in the 80s. No one had long hair like that in the 80s, did they? Nice looking kit though. Who's it meant to be, do we think? Definitely think it's a repaint. But hang on, there's a bit of some shorts coming off there. I don't know, actually. Look. I'm going to ask. I'm going to ask one of the Subutio forum groups. Let's have a look underneath. Let's move that over there. We'll plop that over there. Oh, we for the champions. Oh, I'm loving this. I'm loving it. So we've got a pitch. Of course we've got a pitch. We've got loads of gold stanchions. There's loads of extra bits and bobs in here. Look. We've got some gold stanchions. Not stanchions. Bases. There's one of the stanchion things. We've got some team numbers. Excellent. Absolutely brilliant. And then we've got Argentina. Pretty stereotypical for a box set, right? Everyone always used to get Argentina. One of them's one of the players has gone a bit ropey, but then I'm pretty confident that bad boy is France. Definitely France. I'm gonna go as far as to say that team. That's not the original team from this box. If it was, they're machine prints. This would be a machine print as well, right? So we'll look at that. We've got loads of fence. We've got scoreboards. Oh, hang on, there we go. We're not missing the bits. We're not missing the old uh, frames on the frames on there. Got them all there, that's nice. We've got a full stadium, bit of glass net. There's loads of goals in here. I think there might be a Monday Owl goal. So we've got, once we salvage the Frenchman out of the net, which is going to be easier said than done. We've got Monday Owl nets. We've also, oh God, hang on. We've got Monday Owl goals. We've got normal stanchions. But I'll tell you what I'll do. I'm going to throw up some photos right now of what we actually do. Is that a flicking goalkeeper? on a referee base. <laughs> Flicking goalkeeper on a referee base. So in a bit unusual. I love getting sets like this because it shows us how much people love them. But what I'll do as I was just saying, well, I'll put up some pictures of the goals kind of together or at least with their parts so you can see if it's a full one or not. France players have all done a bit of a dozy walk. We've got, oh, yes. We've got two orange Adidas Sambas. Yes, yes, yes. And then, two balls I haven't got in the collection. We've got two of the FIFA, I believe these are the FIFA balls. Two of the FIFA balls I think they were known as at the time. Excellent. Flicking goalkeepers, was you meant to get flicking goalkeepers in this set as well? Well, if we haven't got one of them. <laughs> There's, I suppose we could put that one in, he's just on a referee face, isn't he? There's the set, there's the rest of them team, just all falling down. I love sets like this. People, there's collectors out there, and I don't mean this in the derogatory terms of other collectors, please don't think I do. But there's other, there are collectors out there who look at sellers and be like, oh no, it's too much work, it's this, it's that, it's battered, it needs putting back together again. But you know what? I quite like it because it shows it's been loved, it shows it's been played with, and it goes in the collection. And over time, I can gradually put things back together. There's a picture there of the teams we should have France. Argentina and a plain white side. So there we go. They've obviously come out. They're the ones that have obviously been repainted on. So there is a repaint. We've got everything now that's meant to be in it. It doesn't say anything about. Oh, it does. It's the flicking goalkeepers. If you can see. It. Oh, hang on. I'm not even showing you. Look. If I didn't. I was just talking about the teams. You might not have been able to see them. France, Argentina, and Leeds. So it's that white Leeds side that's been painted over to be the other team. And then when we turn it round, we have got flicking goalkeepers. So most of the set is here. We've got extra in Monday our goals. We've got extra in, what balls is it supposed to be? It's meant to be playing white balls. It's meant to be playing white balls. So we've got extra in the Monday our goals. We've got the FIFA goals. We've got an extra set of corner flags as well. There's a few breaks, yes, and some of the accessories. I'm missing a dugout, or did you get one dugout? No, you only get one dugout with it, look. You only get one, I'm missing one dugout. I don't care. I've got plenty of random loose accessories behind me. It's better to put it together. We've got a broken FA Cup. That's a complete Brucey bonus. We've got the unpainted fans. 
for the price I paid for that, well happy. And when the box goes up there on the top shelf for the rest, it will be different to the set I already had. I am more than happy with that. How about that for some proper puckers of beauty oh. Well happy with that. Yes, it's the empty box I'm showing you right now. We're going to spin all that around. I'm going to go off now and match all that up, put that all in the box properly so it's all as it should be. Then put it up there on the shelf. Might see if I can find the white team to replace it with. You never know. You never no, but while I go off and sort this out, make sure you head over to my social media channels as well. Check out the collection on there, come say hi. I'd really be appreciative as well if, like I said at the beginning of the video as well, you could share this video with your friends, tell everyone, give me thumbs up, turn on notifications on the subscriptions, and then come back in two weeks, one week, however long it takes me to get another video up. I'll try and be as quick as I can. Make sure you come back and see me then. And until then, as always, keep on flicking.